What's up, guys? We're back here, and we're jumping back into some Slay the Spire modded. So last time, I'm pretty sure we got our butt kicked as the silent uh, lost again to the shopkeeper, which is becoming very, uh, very normal for uh, what we do. I did. I was looking for always whale. I didn't find it, but I did see this bit of rewards, which I thought was kind of interesting. Um, so I'm curious what this will do. It was pretty popular. And then I added the Disciple. Haven't got to play him yet, so we'll see if we actually go through with him currently. But we want to jump in with the Defect today. So I hope everyone is uh, having a good holiday so far. It is the 20th right now. Talk or turn around? I guess I'll talk. So for the first boss. Okay, so it's pretty normal, but there was an extra step of dialogue. Um... Yes, yeah, so the 20th. Me and my wife actually opened gifts last night. We weren't planning to, but uh, we ended up doing it anyway. Uh, we planned on just, like, looking at one and be like, oh, that's cool. And then we were just like, we can just open and enjoy these. All right, we're going to go up through here, see if we can get this elite. Um, it's, there's a chance we could. A very low chance, but a chance is all I need. Um, but we opened gifts. It was a lot of fun. Um, got some new stuff that will be added to the channel because of that but probably not today I have to uh, get ready we have go uh, to see family this coming up week uh, so today's Friday so it'll be I think we leave Tuesday afternoon ish um, so we gotta get the house cleaned and all that nonsense taken care of genetic algorithm it's a little early so we could take it or I can get another cold snap and keep up with these frost. I think I'll do that. We removed a strike, so the damage is pretty good. Remove another card from the deck. Remove another strike. We will start keeping them out. Awesome. And we will get the free elite. We got the strawberry for seven extra max HP. All right, we need a smith here. Thinking zap. Yeah. Zap's always just a good, like anything that becomes free is usually real good. And we will get a free Log of Ulan. Boom, boom. And we get Mobius Coin. Additional 50 coin every time we complete a quest. Interesting. We'll have to actually uh, keep looking at quests. And there, there's Polymerization. Can we? We have to. It's such a cool card. All right. Let's check our quest. So since we do have that coin, Echo Form and kill just a bunch of a bunch of stuff okay so nothing too exciting and then we will smith this because it's exhaustive too so you can do it more than once but now we're on a, the quest for an orb build so we need to keep that in mind war paint upgrade two skills which will be defense but I'm not very sad about that um, it's actually pretty good I think since there's the flame elite here there's two more rest but I kind of want to get some more cards so I think I'm going to zoop over here, hit these two question marks, this elite, and then we'll have go up to that bonfire. That's what I'm thinking. Awesome. Because we need more orb-based cards to make use of this polymerization. Hit you, hit you, defend. So we should take one damage, which is not bad. Now, with a build like this, the orbs will be the selling point. And yeah, we get this amalgamate. Which is four damage, I mean three damage and four block every turn, but we didn't get to use it. It's for a longer form fight, but we need to add uh, more things to really make use of this. Oh, another fight! I wasn't really expecting it, and I think we also want to uh, not use it unless we like really need to, because we only get two attempts of it. So the more orbs we can stack up first, the better off it's going to be. So things like. Uh, uh, that upper orb slots will be really, really nice. All right. These guys are kind of annoying. The thorns, we don't really have a good way to combat it. Like, yes, we have the orbs uh, dealing some of the damage so we don't have to hit them. However, they are still going to punch us. Interesting. They're only doing one now. Uh, I think I'll hit this one now. Okay, polymerization, I guess. So we don't have to 
kick our orb out to the curb, I guess. Ooh. Okay, so that did... I was curious what that would actually do. I didn't pay attention when I was uh, looking at it. So if you dual cast an amalgamate, it just doubles all the effects, which is kind of nice. Channel 1, Lightning and Dark. So you, you do like one... Okay, this is great. What's the upgrade? It's a mix of one. Yeah, because it's one dark, like, it's a bunch of different orbs that you're channeling. You kind of don't know which ones you'll channel, but I don't think that really, really matters too much to us, in a way. Because we kind of just want as many as we can, and then we're all going to, uh, polar like, put them together. Okay. So I gotta do this. We this is gonna be weird. We're going to take some extra damage because of this, but I think it's going to... Oh, we get to pick. Okay, 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 okay. Um, so... Hmm, water and hellfire. Water is consecutive water cards. That's not going to work. Hellfire is just two strength. St crystal and frost. Focus. I'm going to vote through again. Hmm. I think we want this because we want the damage for him. All right, so this does six damage, and then the darkness increases by six. We are going to take a, a hit here, but I'm fine with that. And the goal is going to be to dual cast this baby off. Um, it's a hard one to like really think about. Okay, and should we defend or charge battery? Uh. The goal will be to kill him soon, so I will defend. Alright, yeah, and then we can polymerize and dual cast. I think it will be the way to do this. Get them all together, dual cast out. Yep. Had a, it's a lot of extra thinking for, the, like for that. Uh, gain one reflection. I'll go that way. When zero completely blocks attack. When... A while actively complete like blocking all the attacks, you'll bounce it back. No, I think auto shield is just a good defensive card. It'll be nice to have. Um, I think I want to go upgrade and get this upgraded because the more we cast that, the the better off it's going to be on the amount of orbs we have. All right, so auto shield first, cold snap. This all right should be good enough. A little bit of extra energy next turn. All right, so we got the polarity again. So I think the best one is the light and dark. Like, each one of these has kind of a negative. I have no water cards, so I'm not sure, like, the point of this one. I'm not even sure when water cards will come into, like, into effect. Um, the crystals and frost is good, but I need adjacent orbs. So it's kind of, like, a little lackluster right now. And glass does nothing um, when evoked. If you have three more orb slots, consume your leftmost orb slot and evoke the occupying orb. So you could get an extra evoke out of this. But kind of the point of this one, I think, is just to get the plasma for a longer fight. So combining it together could be good. Um, in terms of, like, what we're doing. Because you could add the plasma to the stack. And then it's a little safer, I guess, from you evoking it. But we're kind of just, like, evoking as we go. We're not, like hoarding them as we could. We're so close. But well we only took two. But that's kind of how it's going. We need some more orb slots before this is gonna be good. Uh yeah, defrag is just good. Actually recursion would also be pretty snazzy. Upgrade a random card and heal. Who are we fighting? I wasn't oh the tree the uh storyteller. Digging's I think what we want to go with though. Gambling chip. It's a good one. Uh, we can set up our turns a little better. I'm game. Alright, so. Defrag's good to have in the first turn. I don't think anything else. We kind of want, yeah, dual polarity. Let's do that. Get this to start with. We'll defrag. We'll push this off the front. All right, something unrelenting, slothful. Let's go slothful, and we can build up a little bit more. Because he's going to sleep for just a little bit. Okay, polymerization. Get all that together. 
auto shields, get this, and we will strike you. I guess I could have hit her, it made more sense. Get a random relic. We got Kuna, every three attacks play, that sucks. Actually, it's kind of just useless. Now, here's going to be the problem. I can't play dual polarity without losing my amalgam, and I don't want to do that yet. So, charge battery. Um, hum, 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 hum. I'd rather get away to two slimes and take a hair bit of damage. I'm not looking to perfect this, so it shouldn't matter too much. Uh, finish it. Let's just anger the mushrooms. I'm fine with that. Yeah, polymerization, that's kind of what I wanted, is just to keep stacking this. And then we will defend and punch the Logabulin. We need to start actually putting him down. I guess I could have used this elixir to have uh, done that. I don't want the copy of Regret. I'd rather take the Dexterity. Makes more sense. The Regret probably would mess us up. Alright, so... Hit you for six. Hit you in the back. Don't dual cast yet. We're still kind of, uh... Kind of waiting on it. Oh, uh, crap. I would do the daze if it did it to my hand. But it does it to my discard pile. I think I'll take the weak. And leave. I do need to get him down, though. Alright. So this hand kind of sucks. Because I don't want to push this off yet. It's up to 27. I want to dual cast it next time I have the chance. You're gone. Get that there. I want to play Zap because it'll push it off. So, yeah. Orb slots are what's going to... What we're kind of really needing. Oh, it's getting it's getting rough. Let's do slimes. Yeah, it's one big slime. And Log of Ulan is getting... Getting big. Okay, defend, defend, defend. I should start... Let's do that to him. This is gonna. This might kill me. Actually, now that I'm looking at it. Um. Eighteen plus twenty-six is forty-four. Plus twenty is oh yeah, it's sixty something. I don't think it's enough to kill me yet, but it will put me pretty close to it. I should put the slime out. Ow. Uh, exhaust all strikes. Or take twenty damage. I mean, will this kill me? Do I have more than fourteen? Yes, I did. Either because either way, I mean, wasn't good. Okay, I have to push this thing off. I'm hoping it'll. Is it forty? Uh, yeah, fifty-five. So polarity. Get me this one. Yeah, kills him. Kind of what I was hoping for. Do this. Bite this. Okay. Uh. Become hexed. That's fine. The dazes don't bother me too much. Alright, let's keep him bit. Okay, and then we get a dex. Because we have kunai, right? Yes. Yeah. Take 18 and obtain one wound. Let's just take the 14. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, do I want the damage or the defense? I just kind of want to keep healing up. The 10, well, I guess we can do this and get one. It still should give us five. We have eight there. Yeah, that's fine. I got some coffee this morning. All right, golden idol. Two wounds, gain two vulnerable. Uh, I wish I could see what my health is. We'll take the 14. Yeah, it's fine. Charge battery. Days will be gone. Eat up some. And then the zap will do some damage. Awesome. Got that kill. They're leaving. This was a, a little bit of a confusing fight, but we kind of see what our strengths and what our weaknesses are because of this one. Okay. None of these. Channel 3 Plasma is the closest one with Meteor Strike, but none of these will work for what we're doing. Unfortunately. Turn 6 starts a mini bot joined by. No, I don't want any bots. They kind of are a little weird. Start of each turn. Pick up, choose two. Choose two. Lose one energy at the start of each turn. Ooh. Choose two energy boss relics. All choices will be out of three random ones. And cannot be skipped. So, I mean, I think I'll try this. Grab bag. 
So, choker, no. Uh, the slimes I think I'll handle with. Yeah, I think I'll deal with the slimes. Uh, include bra. It went pack, but it will put car chases until killed. Contains only one path. No, sounds bad. Become de energized. No. So I think I'll do the bronze core. So we're still up to four energy because we lost one because of this, but we got that. Um, hmm. If you would die and kind of heal your max HP. Awoken. Heal him. I'm unblocked. Uh, not really interested in that one. Channel one frost, but I think that's the best one. Gain one strength, but I'm not using the strength. So I think actually we'll take the eternal feather. It's a weird one. All question mark room can't contain events. Interesting. Ooh, back tick's good though. Yeah, I think I'll go with back tick and find a relic out of here. Because there's certain ones that are really good. I'm just going to have to look. It's not nostalgia. Uh, no. Uh, no. Because there's some that are like polymerization, like that deal with polymerization and stuff, which are really cool. Uh, let's see. Gain three focus, lose one focus over the next three turns. Interesting. Could be good. Bottle of egg. Ha all covers of cards you have are upgraded. Of that card. Oh, of that one singular card. Gotcha. This is a hard one. Choose a cursed card and add it to your deck. Nope. <laughs> There's so much like I could like pick. It's one thing wrong like I dislike about back deck. One strength for every two orb slots. I could just use something. Is there something here that just gives me? Because data disc could be just like straight good. But is there something? Mummified hand could be good. Um. Uh, bees nest could be good too. I was trying to look for the one we got it before. And I just don't remember what it was exactly. I don't remember the shape of it. One random wear card to your deck. No, it's kind of lackluster. Bees nest. Increase your maximum orb slots to 15. Could be an interesting one to go with. Store a copy of one relic. No. That might be kind of what I want to go with. Is the uh, relic, I mean the increased orb slots. Because we need more orb slots to begin with. That's a given. Max seal, ringing soul. Basket of snakes. And I think that's gonna be what I do. Cause I'm not seeing anything else that is like really sticking out to me. Like motion chip. Uh, yeah, if, that's just if you've lost any. Now I can't see the one I was really thinking about getting when I went into this. So let's up our maximum orbs. Cause that'll be good for later on down the road. To the city. Still not comfortable going to the jungle. Alright. So we do need cards. I'm going to go this way for now. Usually I'd go something more question mark oriented, but it's fine. Okay. These are just telling me uh, uh, what quest we have. Strike, defend, dual cast. Don't need it. Charge battery. Uh, I think we can get some better. Okay. This. I don't want to do that yet, so... Let's start working on this boy. Because he's going to defend and steal something eventually. She hasn't stole anything yet, so. He could just be a nice nice orb today. And then defend up just because we can. Alright, finally got dual polarity. Is this. Every time you shuffle your deck, add three slimes. Okay. Let me keep that in mind. Light and dark. Cold snap. Dual cast that front one. Then we'll just defend. So yeah, they've changed grab bag, which I think is interesting. Alright. Zap. Polymerization. 
Cold snap, charge battery, strike. Oh, you hit the... That's one thing, the lightning's gonna try to always hit the... Like, try to hit the minion sometimes. Which will not be nearly as good. And I don't mind the slimes. We have so much energy. And so, like, little uses for it that it's not too bad. All right. Um, I don't think this one's quite where I want it yet, so we'll do this. Okay. I don't think, does he have a card? He doesn't even have a card. Yeah, slime did return to your hand. He Out of all the cards he picked, he picked a slime. Okay, this one kind of sucks. I don't want to play Zap, so we're going to exhaust these. I don't think we're going to take damage, per se, but... Okay... I need dual cast. That's what I want next. So we're just going to continue to wait. We're getting a kind of stally. We need to add some more cards to improve our our plans. Alright, yeah. Polymerization. Zap. Dual cast should do some... Oh, wait. F targeted that. Farts. Well, that sucks. Don't have to hold back anymore, though. Channel another one of these. Slime's out of here. I uh, should have defended, but it's fine. Okay, this first. Die. Dumb thing. So dual cast will finish this fight. And, yep, there we go. Alright, so... Where's my orb slots at? Not what I wanted exactly. All right, next fight. Ooh, we got some Hus centuries. Uh, they're dealing. One's dealing damage. One's not. Do I want the auto shields? I don't think so. I think there's better plays. Not the plays I was thinking of. Um, well, farts. Could combine these two, which is not going to really do me anything. I think I'll save them. Get the damage out. Ooh, took defrag. I want that one. Alright. Plarity. Dark and light. Deal some damage to you. Damage to you. Why do I keep zapping? Interesting. I was confused on what just happened. I do want him dead, so... Okay, intangible. Interesting. It's like he's going to do a flyby. So we should try to heal, I mean, uh, defend up a little bit. We are perpetually weak too, which is kind of annoying. Alright, he's intangible and he's coming back. Such a weird, like, fight here. Actually, auto shields first. Plarity. Lightning dark. Charge battery. Dual cast. All right, he's swooping in. Twelve, eight. We'll take two. All right, we can cold snap, polymerization, strike, slime. This, and then we just have to kind of evoke that one to end the fight per se. Oh, not even didn't even need to do that either. Elixir's not that good. Doom and gloom, a little bit of AOE, a little bit, another orb. Sounds good to me. Remove a card from our deck. Basic strike. Gone. Alright. Keep up this path. We need a shop would do us some good, I think. Do 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 do. Okay. This one's actually not too bad. Let's do this. Yeah. Making sure we'd have enough to do what I was kinda of thinking of doing. So we'll get these together. Make our first amalgam. Which is def more defensively based, four block. Alright, um, we can immediately cast it off, but I don't think I need to do that yet. As interesting as this deck could be, it's not really, it's not gotten there yet. Keep taking my, uh, my cards I want. Okay, this is a good, better turn. Doom and Gloom, Palmerization, Strike You, Do I Dual Cast or Defend? How much would it do? 16 damage twice to the lowest one. So it would kill that one. A bunch of block, which I have none right now. Let's go ahead and do that. 
yeah. Uh, it sucks that the, the lightning hit him twice. Because um, I knew he was going to be dead from the dark. But it's hard to really predict that interaction. So, I'm fine with it. Let's try to get a plasma up this time. Get the glass. Because the glass doesn't do much, but it's fine. And we'll get the energy for next turn. Try to cast through. Or we can get all the dazes. And then we have a ton of energy we can't use. Try again. Stuff like that. Yeah, like... What am I supposed to be doing here? Like, I understand that Hex is a, a bad cur like a bad effect, but... This is a little excessively bad. Alright, blocked again. Nice. Whole hand of freaking uh, dazes. <sighs> Another turn of waiting. Yeah, any any damage. Anything like this would have made my day a lot better. Uh, none of these. What do we got here? Five apparitions lose 41, half, like 50% of HP? Don't think so. As cool as apparitions are, don't think there's the right move. Um, I think this is just a good hand. <laughs> All right, Plarity, I think I want to get this to start with. It's, an, it's a weird play, I know, but I'm going to put those together. I'm going to do this, and I can't block. I wish I had a weakness potion, because he's going to hurt. All right, he took Doom and Gloom. Not too bad. Yeah, I want to get the damage in on this guy, because he's going to scale pretty quickly. Auto shield. Get that off of here. Oh, I throw away my thing. Oh, but it did give us an orb slot. I remember that. He's doing 21. I don't need to dual cast that. I'll do that. Shouldn't matter either way. I, like, either way I do it. Auto shield. Cold snap. Cold snap. Strike. Get him down. Keep the block coming. Alright. He's doing 30 this time. We got 9. If I do polymerization, clarity, you know, the crystal, that should up this one. 15 block, 20 block, 27 block, 35. Awesome. Staying one step above them. All right, doing 21 this time. Boosh, let's, how much damage will it do? 12? Might as well. Get that going, and it didn't even hit the guy I wanted it to. Plenty of block, but, you know, only helps so much if I can't deal the damage I need to. Um, I should dual cast and then defend. 17, and he's doing 36. Uh, we might... We're either dead or close to dead. Yep, close to dead. And I don't think I can kill him this turn. I mean, I laid in as much damage as we could. Yeah, that's it. All she wrote. I don't even think we had a bad f fight against him. I think as we came in a little lower than we should have because of the fight with the uh, the Hex Boy. Whose name I cannot remember off the top of my head. Anyways guys, we're already at half an hour so we're going to wrap up here. Um, that was the defect. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, you can hit that like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.